What power hath our mighty Christ in heaven? All power. What power doth our mighty Christ have on earth? All power. We're too busy sitting back thinking that all our efforts are, we'll just get maybe one or two, we'll just rescue maybe a few of our children, a few other individuals. Maybe some others will join with us. Christian, no. Lift up your eyes and look on the fields that are white unto harvest. See the reigning Christ. Consider it, not just at Christmas. Isaiah 9, 6, For unto us a child is born, unto us a son is given, and the government shall be upon his shoulder, and his name shall be called Wonderful, Counselor, the Mighty God, the Everlasting Father, the Prince of Peace. Of the increase of his government and peace there shall be no end upon the throne of David and upon his kingdom to order it and to establish it with judgment and with justice from henceforth, even forever, from henceforth, even forever, from his incarnation, all power granted to him of the increase of his government and peace, there shall be no end. The zeal of the Lord of hosts will perform it. Christian, pray like you believe Christ is reigning. Pray for this simple, apparently foolish act of preaching the gospel, for it is the very means that changes nations. Get about the business of preaching yourself, for you will have no mightier influence on the world than your preaching of Christ. The hope of America, the hope of all nations lies in the proclamation of Christ and Him crucified. Listen from the dead.